Okay, we got some wild mushrooms drying. Wow, that's pretty cool. We've got wild mushroom. Yeah, drying out in the sun. And then what do they do with it? Yeah, after they dried up, they will uh, take it in the kitchen and they will cook it. Cook it, yeah. And they will make it with mushroom soup, mushroom, oh. uh, mushroom curry, whatever they like. Oh yeah. It's very good. Very good. What type of mushroom do you know? Uh, it's a wild white mushroom. Wild white mushroom, okay. Very nice. And now I'm in the mood for some mushroom curry. <laughs> Are there more? Lots of wild mushrooms. Wild mushroom and they're dried in the, this bamboo. Bamboo, yeah. Made. It's they, from bamboo. They have a smell, don't they? Yeah. It smells like fish it almost. Like a fishy smell of it. Oh, yeah. yeah because it's oity. Wild mushrooms. So we're actually just getting started for our day three and second big day of the trek. You yeah. have to do the plan, the, the itinerary for the day. Today we are, so. we are now we are starting work from the Darapani. Darapani, yeah. So Darapani. we follow all the way, roadway, the hill, to yep. the Timang. About <laughs> five to six hour work today. Five, six hours okay. today. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Yeah. yeah, sounds good. Pretty excited. So today, yep. Tracking up how many meters elevation? Today we are going to climb almost 800 meters. 800 meters elevation. Yeah. Yep. All right, well, better get warmed up. Yeah. <laughs> The machine that is Whisper. Oh. <laughs> so we begin. Day three. Thank you. Bye. Cheers. Goodbye. Namaste. Thank you. Goodbye to the hotel. Kirka in. Yeah. Oh wow. Look at this. Wow. <laughs> Wow. See, they're having food in the mouth. Yeah. So see, in the mouth. They, What's that for? They, they give some corn. Corn? For they, they can eat and oh. they can walk like that oh, way. Oh, wow, okay, yeah. Wow. So the donkeys can carry yeah. up to 100 kilos? <laughs> this, is, this is the way to influence <laughs> donkey to carry the heavy load. <laughs> give, it, give it corn and it yeah. keeps walking? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow, that's incredible. All the donkeys loaded up. That's how they get all the goods up and down, up and down the mountains. Cool, what a sight. So we've had a bit of a problem already this morning. My uh, shorts. I don't know if you can see that. But they've totally ripped up the inside while I was stretching. I was stretching up my legs there and they just completely ripped. So <laughs> they're laughing at me. But that's okay. We'll keep walking. We'll be okay for another bit. And then I've got, I've got some long pants that I can change into. So good start to the day, ripping my shorts. <laughs> oh dear. Namaste. Chocolate? Uh, you know it's strong? Yeah. Because of the it's not too strong. So... Uh, you can purify your soul. Oh, oh we so need that. that. Yeah. In the museum, they say like that. Oh, cool. Cool. Okay, here we go. So, safe drinking water available on the trail. Safe and drinking water is two cents. Yeah, so you pay 40 rupee and there's a little box here and then you can fill up your your safe water. And do you need to put a tablet in? Yeah, it's already filtered one. Already so filtered? You need to do that. There you go, yeah. already filtered, already purified. The 2250 meter above in Danake, so you can get safe drinking water here. Yeah, so this is Danake, the Danake. Little village. Quiet little village, about 2200 meters. <laughs> Good boy. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they try to, you know. Because the, the people they give them sometimes, you know, snack. So they have an apple farm in Danaku, you can see. And it looks like it's a little guest house as well, so you can you can maybe stay the night here. Very nice. Oh, here's another one. So you can see in the gardens, they're growing all the apples. Green apples, red apples. Potala guest house and restaurant. 
and they serve apple juice, apple pie, all things apple, which is quite nice. We have a new trekking friend, a hungry dog. Come on, don't jump on me this time. So I think he's looking for some food. Come on. Cool, a couple of hours hiking and we're going to stop for some tea. We've got a pretty steep climb mixed just after this stop. So we're going to take a little break, have some tea, rest and get some energy before heading up. We have to go that way across the mountain and we go pretty, pretty steep up. So. All right, so we're about to start our ascent up the hill. And you can actually start to notice the landscape changes a bit. You start to see more pine trees, more forest. So look in the distance there, you can see there's a lot more pine trees. Um, it's becoming a lot thicker with the vegetation. So we'll, we've sort of hit this region of, of pine. And then as we go higher and higher and higher, the pine trees will get smaller, smaller, smaller. And there'll be less and less and less of the pine trees until we get above above that uh, green line. Looks pretty good. Um, hopefully it doesn't start to rain. It's a little bit cloudy, misty on the hills, but it looks pretty good. It's not too cold, not too hot. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for the tea. Thank you. Yeah, it's in my other bag, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the start of the steps, we're going to climb up. How, how long will it take? It's going to be a big one hour. So one thing to definitely bring up the mountain, mountain man granola bars. You hungry Mickey? You want some? Wow. It's my favourite smell, I love that. It's so fresh and floral, it's like, it's all sticky here. Mm. Yeah. Oh, wow. this is very white. Yeah, it's, we have the, they have a colorful like white beans and a red one. Ah. Whoa. Oh. Oh. <laughs> too much, too much pressure and uh, water more. Uh, uh, mountains. Yeah. So it's more corner. That's why it's more uh, yeah. uh, more cold. Yeah. yeah. Amazing, we just had a little stop there in a little tea house and it was so cute. Like open fire, cook the salad tea, really, really nice. And it's starting to come up higher in the mountain now.
Maybe in some other country also. Yeah. This there, see? Oh. And sometimes they grow, can yeah. grow also ca cabbage and then carrot. Beautiful. Yeah. Ah, okay, so very beautiful. beautiful. <laughs> Next lunch stop for the day. Oh, amazing. Yeah. Nice. So you got a curry. Yep. Got some dal bat. <laughs> got some roasted potatoes, oh. egg, veg. Egg, veg, fried potato. Yeah, yeah, it looks amazing. Fried mm -hmm. potatoes with egg and vegetables. And this is vegetables. the best potato here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a local potato. Yeah. There we go, the rains come back on, so we've got to do our ponchos. <laughs> Mickey's got a waterproof jacket, she's prepared. I don't really have a waterproof apart from the thin one. A little bit of rain, we've all got about, um, what, about 30 40 minutes, maybe a bit longer to get back to Chemi, um, and that's where we're staying for tonight. So that's um. That's us, we're just hiking through the forest now. It's uh, like all pine, beautiful pine forest, super fresh air, really nice. So we actually have to go through one more village, Kopto, before we get to Chame. So we've actually got quite a bit of walking left and we need some water. We um, ran out of water ages ago. So as soon as we get to the next village, we'll, we'll stock up. But yeah, that's one thing. Just make sure you bring maybe like, carry one to two liters if you can while you're walking and then you can always buy some water or fill up along the along the trail so there's like a lot of little filling stations at the guest houses but you'll need to put in a water purifying tablet just so you're safe and then you can wait like 30 minutes and you can drink it there's no words that can describe this walk like every turn every corner you just see something new something amazing something beautiful like but like look at the mist there's the river flowing down below waterfalls pine trees and then every corner every turn it's just a new view, stunning sight, <sighs> incredible nature. Honestly, I didn't really know what to expect before I started out in this walk, but I can tell you, it's incredible. Absolutely stunning, breathtaking. And we haven't even seen Annapurna yet, so that'll be tomorrow. But yeah, we'll start getting some views of the actual Annapurna range. And once we get out of this little valley, two incredible days, absolutely loving it so far. And yeah, can't wait to carry on with the, with the trek. Just, uh, they're trying to pray, like as a horse, they're trying to pray like a fish and love for the, you know, or make a balance. Yeah. The horse, so, you know. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Just a quick little stop in Koptu. So the rain's just come on and um, we just needed to get some get some water and take a little break. And we've got 35 minutes to the next stop, which is Chame, and that's our final destination for the night. Yeah. Because in the winter it's more cold and they can make a and, uh, meat soup. Meat oh, yeah. Meat, more wow. soupy and it's spicy. Because in the winter, in the, this, this place will be so cold. And yeah. They love to have you know? yeah. vegetables. Yeah. You can't grow. Ah, they so love have, they love to have it. Yeah, thing. so you have to uh, for the winter. So planning ahead. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Say hello. Honey, <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> honey. Hello. There. <laughs> Pickable. <laughs> Silly. Silly. <laughs> Pick a ball. Pick a ball. <laughs> oh. 
Something. We made it. We made it to our next destination, Chame. And it absolutely poured on the way back. For the last 45 minutes, we walked completely soaked in the rain. Phone died, had to put my camera away. So, completely soaked. But we made it and we're staying in this really beautiful little guest house. It's called Mandela Guest House. And like, look at this view. That view. Mountain is just like completely over the top of you. And then they're really cute little houses. Like you can see, it's kind of all like the style here. All cute little. This is the steps up to our little stone. Very, very beautiful. Very nice. You've got little colored ones over there. And you've got the guest hall here. And you've got the smoke coming out where the fire is lit. Absolutely beautiful. And really looking forward to a hot meal, hot shower. And the rain's actually stopped a bit now. So we just got unlucky with the timing. This is beautiful. It's a cute little guest house. <laughs> <laughs> wooden cabin style like as if you were up in like the alps or like skiing or something it feels like we've got this little bathroom i'll show you so we've got bathroom got a real toilet it's not just a hole in the ground we've got a shower here but i think he said it was just cold so um you have to pay for the hot shower downstairs which would be nice and i actually really love this place got, we've got our own little balcony here drying our shoes got our thing drying our stuff here and you can see Misty mountains in the distance. Oh, look at that. That is just. I need to zoom in on that. Incredible mountains. Okay, we're just gonna have a little explore of the guest house. How nice is this? I love this place. It's called Mandela. Mandela? Mandela Guest House, I think. That's what it's called. Hello. 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 Oh, it's nice and hot. Yeah, hi here. Good morning. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> so you already got tea? You got some tea? Yeah, <laughs> black tea here. Oh, okay. So you and Masala tea are. Oh, we're going to have a shower first. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you are going first? Yeah. So, okay. I'm sure. Thank you. So cute. It feels like a. Oh. So the downstairs shower is different to the bedroom. The hot shower is down and the warm cold shower is up. Are you a so, YouTuber? Yeah. <laughs> Making YouTube videos, yeah. Your YouTube channel name? It's yes, J-M-O. What's your name? My Pashang. Pashang? Yeah. <laughs> Pashang, you work here? At the, yeah. It's Mandela Guest House? This place? What's the name of the... Royal Garden. Oh, oh, okay. What's the name of the guest house? World Garden. Oh, uh, World Garden, sorry, okay. Oh, sorry, it's called World Garden. Just turn it and then yeah. hot water. Yeah. Oh, these are the downstairs showers. And, um, yeah, so call me, because how are we going to do the towel? We've only got one towel. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that was the best moment of the day, by far a hot shower after trekking for like six or seven hours just been able to have a simple hot shower oh it felt so good fresh clothes and we're gonna head down to the little guest house now to chill out the little dining area so we're gonna bring down the laptop and mickey's gonna bring down her kindle and we're gonna Not my night cream. we're gonna relax your night cream okay well i'm gonna get some work done mickey's gonna relax wow the sun sets pretty quick here it's dark very fast what a beautiful little spot. I'll put a link down below for um, for you. So if you are doing the trail, you can um, you can find this spot. It's in Chame and it's a little bit through Chame past the police station and you'll find it. But um, yeah, also don't forget, hit that subscribe button if you do like the videos. If you are watching along and you, you know, want to check out some other videos, I've got a lot of stuff from the Philippines, a lot of stuff from Nepal, and I'm actually going back to the Philippines in two weeks. So I'll be there for three weeks, four weeks. So a lot of Philippine stuff coming up if you do like that. Hit the subscribe button. Yeah. 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 So the place is actually called Hotel Royal Garden and Restaurant. It's not called Mandela, like I said earlier. So Hotel Royal Garden. <laughs> I don't know why I said Mandela. My favorite. Uh -huh. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Oh my god. There we go. Oh yeah. <laughs> and you probably also work in a bar as well, did you? You have to try. All right, we got some dalbat from Mickey. Mm -hmm. And we got some more fried potato for me. I had this earlier and it was really good. 
So mm-hmm. and we're gonna do some refills as well. This is so yum. So when you order Dalbat when you're trekking in Annapurna, they I'm not sure is it all around Nepal? It's the same they refill all the time? It's like mm-hmm. a Yeah, so in Nepal they always refill your Dalbat. Dalbat power. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> right. Homebrew whiskey. Oh, yeah, that one. Oh, so it's basically like you, in Ireland we call, we make it from potatoes. Uh, what? Ireland they make that from potatoes. Potatoes? And uh-huh. you, it's from potatoes. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's called pochin. Sorry. Pochin. Pochin. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. It's from millet. 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 And then they keep it in the pot for fifteen days, and then they homebrew it, oh. and it makes. Oh. Ah. So this like is a whiskey. local whiskey. It's like 200 rupees for a glass, and it's 15% alcohol? 15 to 17% alcohol. Yeah. It's more than wine a bit. Yeah, more. Yeah, yeah. 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 It's home brew. Yep, it's home brew. With uh, durum wheat, and it's just made in a pot for 15 days, did you say? Mm. 15 days cooked, and then this is what you get. Uh, home brew, local whiskey. It tastes nice. It tastes yeah. like, yeah. it tastes like whiskey, like watered down whiskey. It tastes yeah. like whiskey when you put yeah. water inside. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Very good. Okay, please go. Nice. Happy uh, Rosh Hashanah. Happy Rosh Hashanah. <laughs> <laughs> and we're also playing some Monopoly deal. Yeah. So. Only this is one button. Okay. Oh. It looks like a sausage roll. Uh-huh. What he's been dreaming of. So, 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 so I picked So Mickey ordered some Snickers rolls <laughs> Me? for Rosh Hashanah. <laughs> Mickey ordered them, James ordered these, but I'll eat them. Oh, well, you know, look at that. We got some Snickers, it's uh, wrapped in batter and then fried. Mmm, <laughs> Snickerdoodle, Snicker roll. What are you going to do, Mickey? For someone who Oh, oh deal break. Oh. Deal break. Oh. Deal break. Oh. You win? I think so. You I, won, I won. won. That's it. Yeah. One, two, three. You win. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Actually, I have a very good cards from here. Oh, you can put the house in hotel yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. House, hotel. Like hotel. Yeah. 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 I can make it. You win. I win. <laughs> there we go. Another game Monopoly deal. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> deal breaker. So, uh, who is the who is de- who is dealing? Me. You Me. Mm-hmm. Uh, you. Mm-hmm. Okay. So good fun. I haven't even had one bite of this Snickers roll and Mickey's already finished. There we go, another day done in Annapurna. We are happy, we're full. We had our dessert, we had a little local whiskey. Let there be light. All right, thanks. thanks again for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you did like the video. And we will see you tomorrow for another day in Annapurna. Thank you and good night.